hey y'all welcome back to my channel and if you're new here hey thanks for stopping by i was so hyped to record this video because i was like oh i'm gonna finally talk and then the audio quality was so terrible so i will be doing a voiceover i am talking for her on the screen because i am her so um i am here showing you some of my damaged ends that i'm gonna be trimming off today in an ideal world i would have gone to the salon to get this done but I'm on a budget right now, and that budget does not involve salon visits, especially when I just went a couple months ago. And um, I got a trim. I think I, this was like February or March. I got a trim, but I've been doing so many more like natural hairstyles, and I'm seeing a lot of single strand knots and a lot of um, like breakage, a lot of um, split ends. And it's really just centered around the front, not the back of my hair. But since I'm taking hair off of the front, I'm going to take some hair off the back. Not necessarily because my hair is in layers because I don't think it is, but it's cut in a pretty good way for me and I'm just trying to keep it even. It's working for me. Not everything is going to work for you for your, on your hair journey. So when you find some things that are working, please don't mess them up. Okay, let's move on now to the actual trimming. Um, just a little like warning disclaimer. I am not a professional. I don't fully know what I'm doing. I just watched a whole bunch of YouTube videos, which I'll link below. And um, yeah, this worked for me. I was able to get rid of like the broken ends and I am seeing like the best hairstyles I've seen yet because my hair looks so healthy. So without further ado, let's get into it. Anyway, it's just hair. It's gonna grow back, hopefully, right? So to not explain the obvious, what I just did was blow dry my hair. I also went through it with like a, a heated comb, a hot comb, hot brush. And now I'm combing it with combs that are increasingly getting smaller. So I started with a wide tooth comb, Denman brush, rat tail comb, just to get it fine and straightened out and to the perfect consistency before I trimmed it. So making sure there is not a single little knot or tangle in there before I cut it so that I could get the straightest, most accurate line possible and move on to the next section. That's the only method to my madness. So again, blow drying, going through with that hot brush, hot comb, hot thing. I combed it multiple times as after combing it, trimmed it, moved on. This obviously goes without saying, but please use heat protectant. We're already getting rid of damage. Let's not add any more. And please use hair shears. Do not use kitchen scissors. Do not use an arts and craft scissors. Just go to the beauty spa store and get you some hair shears. All right. Voila, here are my results. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
Um, my twist out braid outs, every flexi rod set, everything has been bomb since I trimmed my hair. So if you need a sign to trim your hair, this is it. Go to a professional. Don't be like me. Bye. See you in my next one.